<laughs> Red Circle Sunday, here we come. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Red Circle Sunday. <laughs> yeah, I took it. I had to do it. I was like, I was like, oh, I'm gonna play around with these circles. I'm gonna create some ellipses. I almost had one like with this little promo that I did. Got a, a squiggly line through about 15 different areas of the thing. Arrows. <laughs> Yeah. Arrows. I, I didn't put any <laughs> arrows. I was this close to putting arrows, but I didn't. <laughs> oh, Bob, I let everybody in on a secret. It's not really a secret. Of course, it's Red Circle Sunday. Um, so <laughs> Randy has a whole bunch of red circles. So we've decided oh, yeah. instead of speed dating, it's speed <laughs> evaluation. So everybody evaluation. Get, your, get your texting or uh, typing fingers ready or whatever you got there and let's get ready because this is going to go quick uh, we've got our hats mm -hmm. and and i'm ready i'm ready and, and if y'all don't agree with my my my, my hats i'm sorry for you that's all i can tell you <laughs> anyway randy showed me one picture before we even started he showed me one picture i said don't show me anymore. Just yeah. don't. <laughs> it's going to no. be fun. And I did take I did take it's some notes on all round. the pictures. Of That's it. right. <laughs> but I took pictures. Of, I took I took notes on all the pictures. So I got a little bit of a background to each one of the pictures. Some of them not so much because I don't know where the heck they came from or who the heck took them. So, but it is right. What it is. <laughs> but uh, right. Okay. Before we go on, let's do our normal spiel. I let Absolutely. you want to do it. You want me to do it. I'll do it. I, I'm well, shorter at it. Good. You take You're forever. You're better me. It's okay, though. <laughs> okay, On Monday nights at 7 p.m., it is Daniel Diva in the Diva Dimension. At 8 p.m., now these are all Central Time, 8 p.m. on Mondays, it is Texas Front Porch with myself and Tex. Tuesday evenings at 8 p.m., it is Beyond BMR with his co-host, Krista. Wednesdays at 7 p.m. Now, this is when we need to talk about 7 p.m. is Donnie Cho Says Stuff. But if you watch Donnie, Donnie Cho, you need to pay attention because he is talking about moving his show. He probably is moving his show. So yes. make sure you pay attention to that change. I don't know exactly when. but Going to he Friday. Will. I know that. It's, I think it's Saturday. I think he said Saturday. So we're going to oh, check that Saturday? out. I okay. think he said Saturday. So we're going we're gonna to wait for his final... I'm going to do it. So make sure you pay attention to that. At 8 p.m., it is Barton Nunley and his wife, Letitia, on Inhumanoids. At 12 p.m. Central on Thursday, it is Brunch with BMR. And um, I think his new co-host is going to be Tex once he starts his new work schedule. Thursday evenings at 8 p.m. Central, it is Blondes and Booze. Uh, and again, on Friday night, we have Blondes and Booze at 7 p.m. Central. Saturdays at 7 p.m. Central, we have our host with the mostest, one of our friends. It is Paranormal Paul with Paranormal Among Us. And I kind of go back again because Monica is on Thursday night uh -huh. at 10 p.m. Central. Yeah. Yeah. I know. I keep forgetting her because she changed. All right. I'm so then, tell you, you forgot uh, her. I know. I know. I always forget. And don't forget our friends at Paranormal Roundtable. They usually have something going about every night of the week, so you can check them out. Um, on Sundays, of course, at 5 p.m. Central, it's us, Randy and Brandy with Truth or Tinfoil. At 7 p.m. Central, it is Tex and Danielle Diva with their newest episode of Infamous Minds. Yep. And tonight they're covering Gacy. Yeah. The killer clown. Yeah. That's always a good story. That's always a good story. You know, and yeah. I really like I really like the paranormal side of that. You know, people are mm -hmm. investigating the paranormal side of it. And I'm really interested in that to see if they're really getting things or if yeah. this is just all a hoax. Yeah. Is it truth or, or, or is it tinfoil? Was he quote unquote possessed? You know, people I've heard people pose that a couple of times, but they did the same thing for Dahmer and they did the same thing for Bundy. So, you know. Right. Right. It just it's just easier for him to explain that somebody a man can't be that evil. They had to be possessed. No, well, there there's a lot of them that are that evil. H. H. Holmes. Yeah. Bingo. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. There's so there's so many serial killers out there that I just I I just can't. I I I yeah. I'm glad I'm not doing you that. You can't joking. fathom what they're doing. <laughs> You it's know just what I mean? one of those things like mm -mm, no, no way right. but I just wanted to remind everybody out there uh, to help us out please share us out hit the like button hit the notification button make sure yep. you're still subscribed we appreciate you all and thank you
And don't forget, podcast there. If you don't get a chance to watch, you can watch it on a replay. Or you can go out to Spreaker and you can find all of our shows out there on podcast for download for you to listen to at your whim. Done. Okay. <laughs> That's the first time I've put that out in a while. I, I, I guess i got to start remembering that more often. Oh, well, it is what it is. Okay, so we're going to start out with, with the one you liked. Get ready. Number one speed date. Number one, number one GA. Number one. Here we go. All righty. So. This is the first one he showed me. Yeah. I was like, is, what is that? I'm going to tell you. And you, you want me to tell you where I got it from? This came off of a where? Facebook page. This came off Facebook page. This came off of Haunted Texas. Okay. Of course now, it did. Of course it did. But it's unknown. I don't know who took the picture. I don't know. It's, it's San Antonio. And uh, as I don't know the location. And all it stated was, it looks like something like an animal behind my knees. We lit, lightened it up a bit. And there's another picture that I didn't download because I just thought it was didn't belong there in the first place. Okay, and there's nothing you, on the wall. Can you bring us up close? Yes, I will bring it up close now because I just wanted to finish reading that before I got going. All right. So I'm zooming in. That's as far as I can zoom in, guys. Wait, no, there it goes. Ah. It's had to catch up. Okay. Okay, I see a banister of a stairwell. I don't know what else I'm supposed to see. There's nothing there. I, I, I mean, there's a little this right here. But that could be any kind of a bug I reflecting mean, or anything. There, and it's maybe super there's dark. two eyes. Well, it's maybe super dark. Two. They said they've already brightened the picture. And it's no, not still this picture, the dark. other one. So the how did they one see they it in the first place? I don't know. I can't tell you that. The only thing I can think of, they look at it, and they see this up there, and how you can look at it right there and see those faint-looking maybe eyes up there, I don't know. I mean, you'd have to zoom in. That's not say, even oh. pareidolia. Yeah, I mean, look. That's as close as I get. Now, you can see that maybe a little bit darker area right here, but it's just not, it, you're taking it with a digital, digital camera. This is all part of your sneaking, uh, what you call it, all part of your uh, the electronics and the, and, the, and the processors associated with creating this image in the first place. So, yeah, no, uh -uh, not happening. No. Uh, not happening. Uh, Paul not happening. says, I thought this is going to be red circle. Well, they just wanted to do a yellow circle because they don't yeah, want to call I, red circle people. I, circles I are not, circles. I, and I didn't want to go and actually, you know, change the color of the circles on the picture. So, that I, I mean, I don't mind doing it, but I just didn't want to do it. It's too time consuming. So, I just I, stuck with circles in general. Okay. Yeah, that no. Okay, we can move on because this picture sure? is, has nothing Are in it. Are you sure about that? There Are is nothing in this that? picture. Okay, nothing. now the next ones, these next ones we got is two, three, and four here. They're all taken, and you stayed there, you told me, the Minger Hotel in San Antonio. I've been there, yes. Yes. Yeah. These all came from it. And once again, credit to Haunted Texas they were put out there. I'm going to show you the first picture taken. Okay. I'll zoom in a little bit so you can see it. You know, nice little foyer area. So pretty and ornate and everything, right? This is what came next. What? Yeah. That is the next picture in the series. I'm just going to leave my Mind hat it. on. I'm just leaving my yeah, hat I, on. You notice, you notice I didn't pull mine off. We're doing speed, so there's no sense in way wasting move, movements, you know? I mean... I know this is. I, I I don't know how you can zoom in and see that. I don't I don't know. I mean, is it supposed to be? Did, a was phase there of, anything that oh. said what they thought it was? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna no. Actually, I didn't. This one didn't have anything. It was just pictures that the lady had taken when she was there to visit, and she knew it was haunted, and she just went out and started taking pictures. And these I mean, were some of them that she put up there. If you back up to the picture before, you can see somebody yeah. standing on the balcony above. Uh huh. Well, now that that you talk about up here. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that that comes next because oh. she's zoomed in on this, and then okay. somebody in the comments, somebody in the comments comes out and says, "Well, I ain't, I don't know so much about the mirror, but what is that?" That's what I was that's looking where, at. 
this is where I took that off for a second. And I started looking at it a little bit closer. Now, obviously, it's something on the the landing up there, in the walkway area or whatever you want. I can't tell what it is. Well, And the more I zoom in, I mean, it's blocking out the sill. So it's some sort of card out there is what I'm thinking. It's something. But why would that, because what's it, causing this? But you can see the reflection of the window in it. So evidently, whatever it is, exactly. is solid. It's real. It's real, whatever it is. It, but yeah, I don't know what it, it is. is. Yeah. So, I mean, but that what that caused me more pause there than the mirror did by a long shot. Uh, the yeah. mirror is just literally grasping at straws, as you can see. You know, that's that's just grasping at straws there. Yeah, because like I said, when when I saw that picture, even from the distance, you got to remember, I'm looking yeah. at this on a little screen. It still caught my eye yeah. right off the bat. But yeah, yeah. When you go back to that first one, you talk about right up here. Now, if I zoom in up here, you can see it a little bit better. It is a cart and a table with some with a base and some other stuff right there. Yeah, because the, the if you look through flowers. the railing, there's something there. Yep. But that's a, that's a that's a table with vase and flowers and such right there. Yeah, it looks like flowers on it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, so I mean, I included it because the guy in the comments said, "Well, what about that?" Uh, you didn't look very close at it, did you? Cuz I mean, now this, the way he put it in there, it's already pixelated. Right. So now you don't see the flowers as easy as you did in the original photo. Right. And this is why, you know, we've talked about this before, um, having the series of the photos or something like that, or having different stages of the photo being looked at and being blown up. This got blown up too quick. And when they blew it up, they didn't do enough uh, work yeah, with it in that to last actually picture, show it. Yeah, in that last picture, you definitely see the flowers. See this them, first, this they're, first red. Picture, yeah. they're red. They're red flowers. But they're not there in that last picture. No, you can't see them in that last picture because yeah, of how because they did it. It's terrible. But, yeah, yeah, it's blurred and it, it, the the quality's gone down. So once again, I didn't. I don't go out and check metadata on this stuff. I really don't. I don't go out and check all that crap because I'm just going off of what's out there. I don't have the time, nor the resources, nor the want to to go out and check everybody else's metadata to make sure they're not trying to screw things up. up. Well, but it's yeah. quite obvious this one when he put it out there had already been taken from the original, blown up, and then altered in some way, shape, or form to make that look like what it looks right, right there. Because right. the red's completely gone. I guess that's making something out of nothing. That's kind of what it looked like to me, too. Yeah. But uh, once again, we're talking about the Minger Hotel, which is, has a pretty good little history about it. So they, uh, Yeah, and I have seen a picture from that hotel that mm -hmm. I cannot debunk. We'll have to look at that another day. Oh, yeah. And give them to me later we'll, or send it to me and I'll start playing around with it because I may have already seen it and I just don't know which one it is right now. But Yeah, I've, it's I've the seen... cowboy. It's the cowboy uh, standing at the railing. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I've seen that one. But yeah, I can't debunk that one either. But we'll look no. at that one in depth. We'll do one day. We'll look at that in, in depth. Yeah. And I'll see if I can. It's, I mean, the, the hotel itself is amazing. If you've never been there, you just really need to go take the tour. It is, yeah. you know, at least take the tour and go through it because it is absolutely beautiful in there. Yeah. All right. So we're of the same thought on this. This is all mistaken identity in some way, shape, or form. Yeah. Okay. I still got my hat on. The next ones will probably, you might as well keep them on as well. We're, like I said, we're speed dating right now. This is going to be a fun one here. <laughs> five, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. These are all from the League Lee, Lee Kempner House in Galveston, Texas. Okay. Now, these people put on tours all the time as well. Um, two of the pictures were taken close together. One was one of the investigators sitting down and it shows a cloud in the upper right corner, which I'm going to show you that here in a minute. And uh, then after that, some strange reason it caused his shirt color not to come through, blah, 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 blah. There's a whole bunch of explanations behind it. Well, anybody that's ever been in the military knows what explanations are, you know. Uh, it's like excuses. But anyway, if, if you understand what I'm saying, excuses are like, you know what, and everybody's got one. So, here's the first one. This is the cloud that they're talking about. Yeah, 
and this and for those who don't don't know this is this is basically essentially like what we dealt with at hill house it's a it's a there's a place for that it opens up for investigations such as a known haunt quote unquote haunted location but i still stand behind hill house versus what i'm seeing here so what do you see do you need me to zoom up anymore no okay so i see the dude in the middle or the lady mm -hmm. or whatever that is in the middle yeah. they yeah. have lights there their yeah. body is essentially blocking some of that light creating the shadow up on the wall due to the way it's shining mm -hmm. yep i'm glad you saw it too and then if you look at the other side there's there's the same thing on the other side uh-huh over here yeah up at the top yeah look at the top coming from it's this back up way. there too yeah because I mean, this, this this light he's got right here, there and there, boom, he's causing a, a, a shadow going across the entire upper area here. I don't know what they're seeing as an actual mist or whatever it is right here. <clears throat> We're doing a whole show with these things on. I don't care. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, because of course it's the paint job, and if there is even paint there or what is on the wall yeah. exactly, that could be creating that too. Um. I, that's why um, mm. I don't know what does everybody else think yeah because I, I see a couple of comments from before you know like Grand Azar asking do you want to tell what it is it's another question <laughs> and then uh, Rogers could be could be someone looking out the window I mean but we already know it's it wasn't somebody really looking out that window because it was somebody you know there or unless he's talking about it in the in the uh, the one with the mirror, because it does look like it reflects to a mirror, a window of some sort. But right, I uh, just I just didn't look that close at it. I was just like, it, it's still I mean, essentially yeah, a pareidolia. I, I would have questioned the doorway. Yeah. Yep. So definitely not the wall. I no. I mean, because I mean, <laughs> th this is this is just the first one, so we still got a little bit to go with this one. The next one. Oh boy. No, I did not do any of this. This was actually presented like it. You see it right here. Okay. Did that say teeth? Yes. Teeth written right across here. Okay. As you zoom in, this is, I'm assuming, what they're seeing. I don't know what that is. I can't tell you. Does it look like teeth? Not really. Well, I mean, anyway. if, you, if you stare at it, you kind of see a face, but it looks distorted. Yeah, it, lo and it looks like the way a, 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 I should say a chimp or something would make, make its teeth show, you know, pulling their yeah, teeth. It just, it, but it looks distorted. It doesn't yeah. look like. I, I don't know that I would chalk that up as too much of anything, but this here, I don't but, know what they're looking at right here. I don't know. I mean, is there a little bit of a mist there, maybe? I, yeah, that's what, see, this is what red circles do to a picture. They ruin exactly. them. So we yeah. can't see the picture in its entirety. And nope. they just draw us to what they want us to see. But we can't analyze anything else because we're too busy looking at the circles. Yeah, exactly. I mean, this is the, this is that same style light he had in front of him, you know, sitting in that main room. Why do they have the yeah. red lights? Yeah. I mean. Now, don't get me wrong. In, in the army, you know, you have red lens flashlights for for uh, light discipline, so you can kind of, you know, red light. I guess is to this day, I still don't know why, because red light is supposedly harder to see at night than white light, obviously. And it is. Don't get me wrong. It is. And, and, and I, will, I will tell you a little trick on this. We'll we'll use like um like some type of tape to put over our flashlights. Because if you're using infrared or any type of camera, it doesn't matter if it's infrared. Infrared. Yeah. But if you're using yeah. any type of camera, a white light will wash the whole screen out and you cannot see anything. So yep. um, that's why we don't use plain white lights. Mm -mm. But I yeah, don't and, know what he's using here. Yeah, I, I don't know what they're using it for unless they're using it as part of a spectrum light that they we just see the red part. I don't know, but uh, Courtney, Courtney, you know, said something pretty cool right there. I mean, I didn't even think about that part. Teeth maybe looks like they move their hand too quickly. 
Possibly. I don't even know who. I don't know what's going on up here. I don't even know what does, this is. It's, it does look blurry, like it was moving. Yeah, I mean, there's my bet is there's somebody back here, and something moved too quick. Because here's this guy over here, or lady, or whatever's there. Yeah, there's there's too much going on there. Yeah, to, I, I can't make head or tail of this. I I'm yeah. just gonna say they were they were stretching. Oh yeah. Stretch is an under understatement there. Yeah. Uh, we're not done yet though with these guys. Hang on. This one actually kind of caught me a little off guard, but I, I I'll let you see what you see, I guess. Because honestly, now this corner, and people out there listening, this this corner, this door, this hallway here, I, I don't know if that's a, a a light anomaly. It doesn't really look like it to me. It looks like there's a spot that's been that's been fixed. It looks like right here. It looks like a a, a lens flare. You think it's a lens flare? I it, it, it very well could, could be, be because look at the light they've got going on and depending on where their camera was focusing at the time it could have put the yep. glare right there just like you'll see that a lot when you're outside taking pictures and you've got a lot of yep. light you'll get yep. like a rainbow effect or you'll get like just a like a white light going through it could be that yeah um but it looks again pixelated uh, and it looks bit, really yeah. weird well, and, you know, granddads are kind of hit, you know, this looks like a, a, a patch of, if you want to ask me, it's some sort of patch on that wall. Because why is this shadow not there? Is that part of the wall knocked off? Or is there something there actually blocking the view of that shadow? You know what I mean? Gosh, I don't know. I, I don't know. I wouldn't call that, I wouldn't call it paranormal because yeah. we don't know. That is not something that I could directly say, yes, that's paranormal. Yeah. It's because for number one, I don't know what kind of equipment, what lighting they had. Yeah. And, but I, I would suggest it's, it's normal lighting because, I mean, this guy's in color and that's regular white light right here. There's no green aspect to, to, to make you think it's IR in any way, shape, or form. No, but look at how weird it looks. It doesn't yeah. look crisp. It doesn't nope. look, I mean, it looks like they were using some kind of something. I don't, you know, it doesn't I look like 4K spectrum. It doesn't look like 4K spectrum to me. No, no, it doesn't. But it looks like it, the, the photo itself has been manipulated. Okay. Because to I, you know, and I, make it look I like that. And I can't tell what what the shadow is right here. I mean, if it was a shadow coming from the light that's over here, it would be the entire length of the actual corner there. You know what I mean? Because it's mostly down here. You can see it down here. But once it gets here, it's done. It just looks weird to me. It just the, yeah. the, the whole photo looks like it's been manipulated. So I, I would have like to throw it, it out. Yeah. Yeah. Ristol's a reflection of a cell off of a cell phone, possibly. Uh, yeah, I mean yeah. it very well could be. Very well it could very well be. could be. It could be a smudge on the lens or whatever that is, too. You know? Could be. So I mean, I can't say it's paranormal, but then again, I can't say it. This is one of them I can't say it isn't either, though. I really don't know yeah. for sure because I'm I just don't know enough about it. Because I can't say this 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 photo, like I said, has been manipulated. So yeah. I am not I'm not going to say either way. Yeah. So I would have to throw it out. Honestly, I would throw it out. Yeah, I would think uh, it set it up and and, and make it a, a a comeback to look at later if po if it's needed to corroborate something else. Right, 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 but I, like yeah, that. like I said, I yeah. throw it out though. That, that would be something yeah. that I couldn't, I couldn't say for sure. Yeah. So, okay. So the, the, that is number seven. Let's look at number eight. Let me let me get that back on now while I'm thinking about this. Okay, I'm not sure of what that is. I, I'm not either. <laughs> I'm really not either. <laughs> I'm assuming this is a person. Right here. I think this is uh, a window maybe. going outside. Maybe. Oh, yeah. If if that was not a person, they would have circled, have circled it. Person. Yeah. They would they would have circled the entire bunch. So Right, right, right. I would have circled reason, that for sure. Some reason is something in this circle that I don't know what it is. And 
That looks like a tree or plant or something outside. I can't tell you for oh, sure. They got it's two a... circles. There's two oh, yeah. circles up here and here. But they're, <clears> I think what they're trying to circle is the reflections on the glass. It, that's it, that's the only well, thing I could think of. If at. we were looking at a guy, you're right. I I would have circled the guy if I didn't know what that was. Yeah. And Grandizer, absolutely, the pick is too dark to see anything, anything at <clears> all. <throat> yeah, Courtney, the same thing. I was what I was asking. Why would you circle the trees out here? But I'm thinking that they circled these. I'm little thinking they're seeing blackness. like a reflection. Yeah, they're seeing these reflections right through here and then down in here, and they're trying right. to make some sense out of them. Right. Right. Which, why is this so dark in here and it's still relative, looks like it's relatively light outside. It just all depends, <laughs> you know. Some rooms so, are darker than others, so it just, you know, it is what it is, but. Yeah. But uh, definitely, I mean, if I, I come no up and idea. I saw that, I would ask, why are you circling this here instead of the whole thing but obviously that's got to be somebody there and it's somebody they know was there yeah but i mean if you yeah. if you really yeah i would say yeah. man <laughs> yeah that has got to go to all right yeah. so now we got the last one See, they even left a remnant of a of a circle. See, this one confounded me a little bit. Unless they took a grease pencil, they they did a picture of a picture. It looks like to me. No, what it looks looks like to me is they took a picture and then cut this out of it. Well, so you yeah, can't I mean, see well, in context what we're actually looking at. No, but why do I have this faint part of a circle right here? Did they just circle something on another picture, take the picture of that, and then try to get rid of the other circle? It could have been on the main picture. <laughs> that's that's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. I mean, because obviously is, this comes, and you see the, the, the lines down here, they had some sort of 4K going on. You know, the Spectrum camera. So why yeah, I've only that. got this? That's all I've got. Is that right there? Yeah, they cut that out of something else. So again, what what do I got? Why are you going to give me a picture of something I don't even know what I'm supposed to be looking at? You know, uh, honestly, right, this is, right. Well, this how is do you know? Like, how do you know? It's a blob. It's a blob. Okay, we're all going to get eaten by the blob. It's 1950s. I mean, that just is it. It's I don't want to take the paranormal level to the, 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 the cryptid level where we get nothing but blurry videos and blurry pictures everywhere, and that's all you're ever going to get. It just drives me insane. But people are going to keep doing it. No matter what, they're all going to keep doing it. Courtney, wants, as you you see, to, Courtney wants you to zoom back in, please. Okay. The, to the white line, looks like they failed to blend in the image in Photoshop. Oh, you know what? They very well could. I mean, that could could be, but it looks like somebody started to draw a, a line around this in another picture is what I was thinking, too. It looks like to me that they cut out part of another picture that has already circled. Yeah. And recircled. Maybe that's it. They never sent it to me, Grandizer. I find these things. I don't. I don't go asking people for them. I they, 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 I find them out on the web, and that's where I grab them. So. <laughs> Right, right. Nobody sends me anything. Yeah, I'm trying to see where she's talking about. I mean, if you talk about right here, uh, Courtney, because uh, I don't even know that it's e it would even be a good blending of an image because, I mean, it's literally so dull and so faint that you would have to, I mean, you, you step back. Yeah, you notice there's something there, but until you zoom in, you really don't even know what you're wanting to look at really if that circle isn't there i'm not looking at that a second time yeah 
Yeah. Um, no. Just, let's just they, move on. Let's just move on. This one's giving me a headache staring at it because there's just so many things that are wrong here. Yeah. And, and I think if she's right too, that I, I know it's, this, this line right here that she's talking about, I'm, I'm guessing, yeah, it could easily have been that way. So, but we're going to keep the hats on for this one. That one just could not, I couldn't, I wouldn't have wanted to try and look at that one again. So, okay. So now we're going to get out of Texas next. Oh, yeah. We're going to Oklahoma. Ooh, we're going to Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Yeah. This one and uh, 10 and 11, this uh, a few years back, a guy's boss had bought a piece of land that this guy was clearing and moving stuff out for him. He was going to make a uh, do some farming on it. Well, it turns out that uh, the house gave him a creep, so he walked in and out of it a few times, and he turned around and he started taking some pictures and stuff like that, looked for, uh, for old car parts, etc. He was trying to scrounge, you know, and then he took some pictures of things left and right. So the first one... What? <laughs> That's what I said. It's even got the arrow. Okay, so zoom in. Let's see what we're looking at because I don't know. It just looks I don't like... know. I, I still don't know. To this day, I see a bush. Okay. Brush. So what does everybody else see? Because I see a bush. <laughs> I don't know what he's looking at. I really don't. I can't Is it like the it. little, like you can see the brow and the eyes and the nose, kind of like That's, that has to be it. Because when I was reading a little bit that he that he wrote about it when he when the guy put it out on the face on the Oklahoma Facebook group, he he was uh, it just gave me the creeps. If 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 I turn around without that there, and I turn around and I look at that picture right there, I'm not even thinking anything about the creeps of it, you know, and okay, I don't even it nothing even made me think because you know the next one i'm going to show you the next one right now he made sure he took a picture of the roof too oh and i love the circle and arrow that's pretty nice yeah circle and arrow he's taking care of us make sure we know where to look now like there would be what's there it's a hole in the roof another it's an old shingle stuck down in there yeah again we're looking at pareidolia yeah now I want to do this real quick while 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 y'all look at that a little bit longer. I am going to go ahead and see if I can grab. Uh, let's see here. I'm gonna to go to Facebook because I should have grabbed this and brought it with me, but uh, there's a picture that he took of the entire side of the house. I want you to see the entire side of the house, only because you know that was one of those that he he was really really grasping at straws with it to start with <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah love it hair force hair force says you guys can't see that giant bigfoot standing in that hole <laughs> where oh wait is there a circle he's around popping it? out of the roof air force he's popping what? out of the roof he's so tall all right let me get this in here that is that's gonna... Grasping, right? Oh the reason man, I got, that is yeah. The the main that, reason I that's, yeah. The oh, text says you? I clearly see ten Bigfoot and twenty dog men. <laughs> Good catch. Good catch. Okay. Good catch. Now. I didn't even see that. <laughs> now let's see here. I'm going to bring these up one by one. You almost got it. Yeah, Spend oh yeah, I got it. I just want to make sure. I, I, well, I, there was about three or four I was actually downloading on that one, actually. Right. Just because I wanted you to see the whole house and everything, but let me get the whole house looks be. like like a paradoxia mecca. Yeah, exactly. And like you'll find something anywhere you look. This is the house. Oh, Lord. Okay. That's so what I meant. It's house. like you look anywhere, you're going to see something. Exactly. And that's that's one of the things I like. Okay, oh, zoom man, in on the is... house a little bit more for me. I guess I'm going to show you what I mean. To yep. Where at? Oh, 
Okay, I'm looking around. I'm looking around. I'm trying to I see, see it. I, you see it? Black dog. There you go. <laughs> but you just see all kinds of stuff. Yeah. If you want to put it to it, you could you could come up with you sure can. It. You sure can. So, but you know, there's a picture without the circle. Which okay, oh. yeah. But I just know. This is clearer than the one with the circle. Right. Now, oh my goodness, I've got a cat that has decided that he's got to be in my way. <laughs> every time, I mean, every Sunday. Well, the dog started the barking cat knows out, it's circle outside. Sunday. The, yeah, and he's like, uh, let me out now, even though you know how to open the All door. All right, though. zoom in on the window. Okay. And I don't think it's a window. I think there's a shutter there. I'm fairly certain that that's a, that's a door to a shutter. Yeah, I think so, too. I think the light coming through is maybe holes in the, the uh, roof. The ceiling or the roof, yeah. Yep, yeah. in the roof. I agree. Actually, Grandizer, I I would bet money. Just look at what I'm seeing on, and I'm gonna back it up to that first one. Just from what I can see right there, minimum of the fifties, more than likely is probably in the thirties to forties. Was when yes, that was text, actually those are glowing eyes of a demon. Yes. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Did somebody wake him up? I thought he went to bed. Yeah. <laughs> But anyway, so, you know, you got that. Oh, wrong one. You don't want to see that one yet. That's for later. So you can see there's a lot of spots. You could you could grab anything out of this bunch, you know, obviously. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, but so I was like, you know, it's good to see the red circle thing on it. Because that's, like I said, we're doing the red circle thing. I, yeah. I mean, it is. It is what it is something. after that. So Right. And that, now we're back to that one. And, you know, like I said, now, see. It's a blur, more blurry, but when we were looking at the original at the other photo, this wasn't even here. No, it wasn't. It just looked like a hole. Yeah. So I don't know if something happened between the time he took. If this one was a different one, it doesn't say. He just put a bunch of pictures up. So and these yeah, are the I don't ones know. He had the on, so yeah, I don't know. I'm still gonna say he's he's grasping at straws at best. Yeah. Okay. So now. We're done with that one, 10 and 11 there. 12, this is from Parallel Forest, Wichita Mountain, the wildlife refuge in Oklahoma. And this was taken 13 years ago. That's all I've got on it. That's all I'm going to have on it. <laughs> I don't know if they ever figured out what the heck's going on with it. Because I sure as heck can't. Uh... <laughs> that's what I said. Um, uh, yeah. uh, that's all we got. That's all we got. That's all you got to work with. I just can't. I just. <laughs> I mean, honestly, if you're not, if you're going to draw a circle on something like this and blow it up to this level, where you, I can't even tell what's a tree and what's not anymore. I know it's 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 like it's bad. This is bad. Yeah, but somebody somewhere is figuring that there is a figure in that circle somewhere. Well, I'm I'm pretty sure they're trying to tell us that's Bigfoot. I, I kind of think so too, but uh, any other credible. Bigfoot evidence that I've ever seen has a lot more substance to it than that. I don't even know what to what to even call that because if it's a Bigfoot, what's this? What's block, blocking this? What's blocking that? You know, hey, let's zoom up again and see what we got more. Oh, looky, it's more blurred. There's a face right. there, though. Right. Not, we got a face. Well, we don't Come even on, know guys. what it is. Now, Kevin, Kevin said elk. But well, you know I, what? We, we know Oklahoma. what an elk is, even at a couple hundred yards. Yeah. 
We don't I would have to blow it up for you. Oklahoma you either, can though. see yeah. what it is. Yeah. So. I mean, maybe this is the case. Maybe it was an animal in the woods. They took a picture of it. They didn't realize it was there. And thinking it's yeah. really something and blew it up to the point where you can't even understand what it is. Exactly. And that's that would drive me. Courtney says it's a ghost nuts. of Bigfoot. Ooh, I like that. Courtney says it's a ghost of Bigfoot. She solved it. We're done. Uh okay. So you're trying to tell me to keep moving, huh? <laughs> no, I, I said Courtney <laughs> said it was the ghost of Bigfoot. I said she solved it. We're done here. <laughs> Nothing to see here. Move along. Move along. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Just keep moving. I'm, I'm with her. Yeah, we're done with it. But either way. Okay, the next one. This was also done in Oklahoma. Actually, there's two of them here. It was this one. Uh, this one, unknown location in Oklahoma. And I'm just going to throw it up there. And I'll tell you after you see it what we're looking at. There's no red circles on this one, though, unfortunately, guys. Okay, there's a couple things going on, but they're all explainable. Exactly. Okay, so what's your first rattle out of the box? What do you see? Well, right out of the middle, there is a kind of a white splotch. This there. right here? Yeah. Right. Okay. And then over to, uh, I guess, would would be my, my, my right side. It right looks here? like there's like somebody sitting there or kind something. Right here? Yes. Okay, kind of what I was thinking too. My my biggest issue is now this is what was actually said about this photo. Okay. Supposed little girl ghost against a brick wall. Where? I mm -hmm. now I'm asking you. <laughs> well, that's my thing know. is is I see something that's kind of weird. That little white spots, but I see people yeah. on the other side. You know, maybe that's pareidolia, but that's the picture I'm looking at. Again, it looks yeah. like from a screen, like they were they took the picture Over off here. of a, a computer Another screen. Another porch. Yeah, yeah. And <clears throat> how could they tell it was a girl? I don't know. I don't see nothing there. And this over here, I can explain everything here with shadows. Well, blow it, blow it up over there. Over here. Yeah. I don't think there's people there. I think there's there's something that's been laid up against a well, how would we know or something? Yeah, you can't tell. again by the lines in door. the picture. By the lines yeah. in the picture, they took this, they took a picture of a computer screen. Yeah, that's what it looks like to me, too. So, and we all know that you cannot do that. And there's the telltale right here. Because that's part of the picture right here. That little yeah. arrow. That's not you, my arrow over here. That's you can't arrow. take a picture of a computer screen. Nope. You can't. It's even it, as a screen capture, you know. I mean, even if it's a screen capture, you're still going to have those lines. Yep. So the next one, they actually put the circle around it for you. Yay. It's not red. <laughs> kind of disappointing. It's not red, but you know, that doesn't deserve a red circle. <laughs> it it has not earned the red circle. Therefore, it shall not have a red circle. It gets black circle and be quiet about it. <laughs> so. They distinguish this as a little girl. I don't know how. The only thing you could distinguish out of it, those two marks right there, and maybe a little bit of a, of a shadowy figure, but you're grasping straws even with that. Uh, Courtney, tell your mother that I would believe that it was Mothman before I would believe that it's a spirit of a little girl. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, because we do have the glowing eyes there. We do have the body. Yep. Yeah. I, 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 I could believe that more <laughs> than I would believe this is the spirit of a little girl. Yeah. I, I mean, that, we all know that, that, sense. right. We all know that spirits manifest in many different ways, but mm -hmm. I'm not going to sit there and call it a male or a female or whatever, because I don't know what it is. 
You can't tell what it is. I mean, no, you literally cannot it's tell what this is at all. It's Mothman. Well, if I didn't believe that Mothman was a big ass barn owl or barred owl, I would I would agree with you. But I already you never, figured it out. It could be Mothman with, with his that. wings around the front, just then they're going, hmm. Yeah, no, I'm I'm good with that. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. All right. So we pretty uh, much destroyed that They want to know what the face is at the top with the shades on. Yeah, the that's one a, with the little beard. That's a. Uh, that's actually a uh, potted plant. Yeah. Looks back, like glasses and maybe have a little beard on it. Yeah. Isn't that weird? How it looks like yeah. that? That's pareidolia, everybody. Welcome. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think. Well, I, I think it's a potted plant. It, it kind. It's what I thought of it as it was in the first place. Hey. Being on the it's side, something it, hanging it, it, there. Yeah, yeah it's, it's clearly something. The, yeah. yeah. So yeah, I agree. It's, it's says it's a dog, dog man, cloaking. Oh yes. man, dog man, dog man. Yes. All right, let's see what I got next here. Go with that. To go to... That's pretty good. Man, my head is starting to sweat. Woo! This puts off. Ooh. What? Keeps in the heat. Makes your head sweat. <laughs> it, that way the government can't read your brain I know uh, There's a reason behind all this stuff don't you But you can definitely listen? catch me in a thermal <laughs> I'm sure the, the heat is emanating from here <laughs> Oh yeah Hey Grandizer I'll go get a picture, picture of the fat man I've seen that picture And uh, that that one it, While creepy yeah I mean But it, it, could, it could take up a whole show Just going over that because you could pick it apart or you could you could try and debunk it or whatever. It's hard to debunk, but I've seen people try and do it. So I, I probably need to take a look at that one again. Okay, so now we're gonna go to the next one. Now let me let me bring up my little cheat sheet here. Okay, little girl. Okay, this next one comes from a tea room in Perth, Australia, caught on closed circuit TV. Uh, their closed circuit, uh, not this one, obviously, but his his uh, his security cam. Okay. This is out of Perth, Australia. Now, Very this nice one, circle. I still took this off because I still haven't looked at it really close yet. Okay. But there is something there. As we can see, I know he circled it for us and it draws us straight to it. Makes me want to look at the rest of the picture, though, and see what else I can find. Well, let's take a look at it very closely. Yep. And then we'll back up. This is what he caught. This was, like I said, he found it on his security cameras because it tripped his uh, motion detector. <laughs> very true, Grandizer. I am nice and fat. I am pleasantly plump. Thank you very much. Yes, Ag Aggie Joy. Yes, they have great circles in Australia. Great circles. Crop circles, too. It's better It's better circles than what I could have done, so, yeah. I, I Honestly, in this situation, obviously, it set off the, the cameras to start with, and I really can't see anything else that would have caused it and being night well, vision this, that it is. This, is. this is my thing, too, and I'm sitting here looking at the image that we're trying now this is where it, it gets me because everything around it is crisp. Yeah. You Except know, that's real. very clear, but that image is kind of like foggy, I want to say. Yeah. yeah, misty almost. Right. Right. Now, as I zoom in, you can see a little bit of the stuff through it, you know, behind it. And if you really look at it, you can see that this perhaps might have a little bit of long hair coming down the sides of the face. Yep. I mean, I tried to look at it. I tried to look at it. You know, a lot of people with with their CC cameras, you know, their 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 uh, their cameras for for security, their security, they get bugs on the lenses a lot. But the this is not a bug on the lens. This too. It's too distant, you know what I mean? And it's it's kind of behind this bit right here. As you can see, this this little pillar and and table. 
Yeah, it's because it disappears that. behind the table. Yeah. And it looks like the, the, the shadow. This is this is another thing that I had I thought this might have been too much of a shadow because you see the shadows come back this way. Right, because the light is going this way. Now exactly um, if you we got to remember this is a video so i would like to find the whole video if that's ever possible i, I tried i couldn't find anything but this because it was but all this. part of a, you see of a, that makes me wonder but it was part of the bbc report on it the bbc oh. actually did a report on this when it came out and they well, had they had no conclusion their their people looked at it and could not find any evidence of tampering at all now I don't know if I could say that because, but you know, when you've got light from one side and then you got IR coming from another, it can create this this effect right here of almost like a blackness. Right, right. But it, that lights. that blackness would be there in every that's, frame exactly. that that camera is is recording. And it that's would be what I'm, that's what I'm betting because if you look right here, you can see the same thing. Yeah, yeah. So it would be there in light. every yeah every every frame that was recorded. So that's a light play, but I still cannot explain this. I can't do it. I, I could try and debunk it. It doesn't look now. I don't know if anybody else sees anything that I'm missing, but I don't see any evidence of anything being laid in there, of it being tampered with, really. I don't see any telltale signs of, you know, Photoshopping, you know, which you're going to have that, that little white line that kind of outlines everything, you know. I don't see that in this one. You know what? I'm saying that with the information we have, which is not much, yeah. it's yeah, minimal. Not much. Yep. I would say that's a good catch. I think it is too. That's why I took the hat off when I first pulled it over because I remember, like, I wanted to look at it closer, but I wanted to look at it on here closer. I yeah. didn't want to do it beforehand. But you know, like I said, it, it, and like we 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 talked to everybody out there it's like we can only go based on the information we have which sometimes is very minimal but if we had more information maybe our opinion would change but just mm. based on what we have right now <clears throat> I, I and i don't know hair force i don't know that's, that's, a, that's, that's a good the case. catch i don't know that the the uh the light up top is reflecting off of camera lens because camera lens is up in this upper corner and I wouldn't have expected it to reflect at this point. I would have expected it to reflect here in this area somewhere because it's right here <laughs> coming this way. So, okay. yeah, I wouldn't have expected that to be th there. No, I would expect it to be either. more to the middle. But then again, what we're talking about is that if it is a, a camera light problem, yeah. this would be a problem in every frame of every video they have every night. But they said the motion detectors went off and caught this, yes. which is true. Now, yeah. again, I mean, there could have been, a, say, say a mouse. Let's just let's just call it a mouse. A mouse ran through. Yep. It triggered something, and then it caught it like that. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, but if if we're just basing it on the information we do have, I yeah. would say it's a good catch. And and yeah, like you said, and I understand if all the shadows on the table, I see what you're talking about. This thing's not emitting a shadow at all that I can tell. And once again, the 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 lay of the shadows is going like this. The camera is facing right here. This would have reflected somewhere in this area, not there. Yeah, I don't I don't think that the light and the camera are facing each other. Because like we talked about that earlier when I was talking about putting tape over our flashlights and stuff. It yeah. will wash your screen completely out. Yeah. If you have a white light shining into your video camera. Yeah. It'll 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 and be pretty sure. like look just pure white. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure that's either either a street out there or somewhere out in another lobby part. Because like I said, this it is could a be even room. a security light up in the yeah. corner. It very well could be an exit light. Or but I don't like that. I don't think they're facing one another. Yeah, and I don't think it's a, I don't think it's a bug. I don't think it's a spider. Uh, it just once again, if I could have gotten the whole video and seen the actual movement, if if we could have seen, if you could have seen movement at all to start with, honestly, I know. I like Courtney if says, we could have got that, the yeah, whole video. That's what Courtney said. The whole video. But unfortunately, 
Yeah, unfortunately, I couldn't get that. Uh, And I don't know. It didn't say in the report whether it was true video or if it was, you know, the time lapse type, you know, where it takes a a frame here, three seconds later, takes another frame, three seconds later, takes another frame, that kind of deal. Well, normally when they've got, if it's motion detected, it takes real time video. it It should take 15 seconds of video right then and there. Right then and there, or, or 30 seconds, depending on, you know, how they have it yeah, set. Yeah. So um, that's why the video itself is clean, or the picture yeah. itself is clean, because it yeah. will. I mean, that's crisp. That is really yeah. crisp. Yeah. So. I don't know. I, like I, I said. Yeah. I, I can't say no. You know, I think I think it's a good catch, I'm not going to say no. Really I'm not going to say no on that one, just because we don't know everything. And the video, no. of course, would make all the difference in the world. Oh, yeah, of course. Because we can see what we could see where it clicked on and where it clicked off. Okay. And that's well, what we would need. You know, yeah, uh, 15 seconds would tell a whole different story, I'm sure. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, we'd be able to see if there was any kind of movement or if it just appeared and disappeared. Then we'd know. Right. Right. Okay. So. I'm out on the fence on this one, but we're going into one that kind of got me a little out on the fence as well. Yeah, I'm, 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 think, I'm, I'm with you on that. I, I'm thinking this next one we'll be able to, it's, it's, I know we're up to about 57 minutes, but there's three photos here. Okay. Actually, there's okay. four counting the last one that has, kind of pulls everything together. This is out of Savannah, Georgia. Okay. This is the Sorrel Weed House. These were taken, it does group uh, tours all the time, okay? Here's the first one. Everybody wants to take pictures of this this mirror because this is supposedly one of those mirrors you look at and, you know, so forth, so on, right? A a scrying mirror, okay. (laughs) Yeah, I just don't like using the word scrying because it's just, it's one of those things that, okay, I'm going to say Beetlejuice three times. Here we go. All right, but. Uh, Candyman. yeah. Bloody Mary. Come on. No, no, no. Don't don't call Candyman, okay? Uh, I'll take <laughs> Beetlejuice. Don't call Candyman, all right? <laughs> all right. Okay, but you see, you know, the, the group's there, and they're having a good old time. They're taking a picture like they, they think they need to, right? Right, right, and right. And right, as I, I zoom that. in here, as I zoom in here, you can see this guy over here. He's taking his picture with his phone at what it looks like to me. All right? Then everybody takes pictures. The next photo, people are moving away. Somebody tried to say on there that, hey, the guy's gone. The guy has already left the pit, the frame. I already know that's happened. There's no way you can tell me that he didn't. Okay. One of these things is not like the other, though. They say that this person was not in the room. There's one thing it lacks. You can't, you, there's no, you can see this lady's face. You can see these people's faces. You know what I mean? They're quite pronounced, right? That was not as pronounced, but I've seen, remember the, the boot hill photo that we, we debunked as being a mannequin, right? Yeah. It right, has that same fo- back, kind of look. Back up. Back up the two photos. Give me the okay. first one. First one. Yeah, right, you want me to zoom in? Yep. Okay, you see how many people are there and how many people are taking pictures, right? I'm going to come what, to think of what, it, you know, what are we looking at there? We're not looking at anything. This was just a base photo. No, I'm looking at the the above the 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 lady with the reddish brown hair taking the picture. She's looking into that right there. All, all, no, back up. There you go. Above her head. Above, above her, her head. head. This guy? Yeah. This what guy? is that? It's a guy there taking a picture. There's a there's a photo, but I don't. I'm guessing he's got a beard. But that's a person there. It looks kind of weird to me. Yes. Yeah. I, I, I looked at it too. I can't tell what it is. It's weird about it, but my guess is he had a beard. Well, he's relatively tall. Could he yeah. possibly be blocking the other dude? That's a very good question. 
they said, like I said, when we get to this other one, that they didn't see this person in the room at all. Now, I agree. I think the other guy, if he would have been there, the other guy would have blocked him out big time. Right. Yeah, that was a big guy. That was a big guy. Yeah, now, he would have definitely see, blocked him out. Now you see why I got my, my red circle here. because Yeah. But my issue still is, this, just judging from what I'm seeing, let me go back to this because this is, this is what, he's, that person, thing, whatever that is, is not much smaller than what the other guy was. But he was. He was bigger than that dude right there. And I think he was closer to the mirror, too. Right. So, was he blocked out? Now, this is the posing of what they they put on the website with this. This person right here, the other guy's still there, and this thing is blocking him out. I'm like, no, that ain't no, there ain't no way in hell. Excuse my language, that ain't no way that that's gonna happen. Okay, go back to the first photo. Okay. And the only reason I got all three of them so you can see the progression of everything. But all right, now zoom back in. Yeah, he would have definitely blocked him out if he was in the back. But I'm yeah. not saying that couldn't happen. I've taken a picture of a room and somebody that wasn't supposed to be there was there. Yeah. You know what exactly. I mean? It just yep. showed up in the picture. I've done that. Um, well, <sighs> now, as you look at it, say you look at that right there, you see the angle and everything, right? Yeah. This angle is a little bit different, too. So did this person just turn around and take another pick after walking a step or two back? Yeah, because if you look, there are some people who are who were in the first picture that are not in the third picture. No, they've already moved off to the side. They've already or moved off. Or Absolutely. And now you've got these people that weren't really in the first picture. Because some of these, that lady right there wasn't in the first picture, I know. There's her back of her head right there. And I bet now that I look at it, look right here. See the green right here? Maybe that, that guy is walking past them in the back somewhere. I don't know. Tough to say. I, I'm just saying it is say, they weren't they weren't consecutive pictures. They supposedly but were, but saying, you're you're still talking about you're talking about probably five to ten seconds minimum, if not a minute at some point, because there's just too much too much movement of the people. Right. And then my other thing is, is if you look at the guy who's not supposed to be there, or they didn't see there, he looks a little odd. Which one? The the guy in the first one? No, this picture, this, the this one, one that they supposedly said he wasn't there. Yeah. He looks a little odd. Out of place, right? Yeah. But see, and, and as I get up there, now remember I talked about Photoshopping, right? And I ain't saying that these people did this. Don't get me wrong. But there's some, you can see there's a little lightning around the head port, part right here that goes in along with it. It could just be the blurring and the pixelation right here. Well, if you look at the lady's head directly to the left, you could see right that the light is creating that white line on her. Yeah. So but that's obviously that, the light. No, right. Because that's her, this lady right here's reflection right there. But what is concerning me is the neck of this guy. Yeah. This area right here. See how it's discolored? Yeah. It's like it's not really what it should be. Like. I mean, it, it looks like. He you looks got the out head. of place. He doesn't yeah. look like he belongs there. No. And I mean, if we could see more of what he was wearing, that would help us out. Yeah. Um, because it could be something of a different era. I mean, yeah, that's that's kind of what I was thinking. But you know, like I said, something about it just the face it, it and just, stuff. Uh, something's it, it weird looks, about it. I'm gonna it go with that. Something's weird. Yeah, it yeah, almost looks man weird. Mannequin -y, you know, 
So I'm not put. I'm not going to put my hat on. I'm just saying I'm not no, going to no. put my hat on because that he's out of place. Yeah, he he looks like he doesn't belong. And you know, if we could see any kind of real facial reaction of him, and nobody's reacting to him at all, obviously, so they don't see. Him. That's okay. the thing that gets me um, to go back to the first picture. Hair Force wants to see something. Okay. First picture coming up. All right. What are we looking at? Back of the lady's head. Back of her head in the mirror. It should be her face. I think he's talking about this one right here. Yeah. I think he's. Yeah. I, it, it's tough to say. Because I can't see, I don't see eyeballs, but that could be washed out from the flash here, too. Yeah, it could be. It could be. And or, she does, it does look like she has a video camera in her face. Yeah, so, and I'm looking, I'm looking right here at this lady right here. Is Am I seeing her shoulder and such right there? But it can't be. It's got to be her, you would think, right? Yeah, it's, it's her there, yeah. Because... You just can't see enough, unfortunately. I can't tell, but yeah, I see where I see where uh, where he's talking about there. But my question is that this is behind her. This technically, this flash right here, or this light is behind her. Then <laughs> could it conceivably? Because you can see a little bit of her of her shadow going right here too. Could that be causing you know a wash out of her face in the mirror itself? It's possible. Yeah, I, I agree with you. I agree with you, Hair Force. I mean, it looks like this looks like it the looks back of her head. Weird. It does. It, it does look like the back of her head. So. Yeah, but they said that she was there. Yeah, she was I'm in the here. picture. Yeah, the debate is not about her. But the I just wanted to see about, if I could picture anything else out there. <laughs> yeah, the debate yeah. is on that dude that looks way out of place. Yeah. And he's standing by himself. Oh, I don't know. And you he know, just looks odd to me. Just looks. Yeah, her like that right there. That means he'd have to be. Know, she's right there. Yeah, he'd have to be over in this area right here behind this guy, back in this he, corner. He'd have to be somewhere. up 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 against that wall, however far that is. Yeah, yeah. He'd be back, you know, way back behind. He'd be a good ways back. Yeah. Yeah. Now she turned around talking to him. Her. She could be turned around talking to him. I don't know about that. I think he's too far back there. I think she's looking off her, to her side or even to turn around to look or yeah. who knows. So, but I'm just going to say. Can't say yes. Can't say no. Mm -hmm. Can we find the guy in the picture that's taking the, that's in the mirror that's taking the picture? <laughs> now, uh, I'm assuming. Come to think of it, I don't see him at all. Unless. It's this one right here. Now he could be out it's, of the picture by now. Because well, he's talking about who's, who, who's physically taking this picture right now is what he's talking about. He, I think he's too off centered. I don't think you'll actually pick him up. I think he's behind the girl in the red. Yeah, right in this area. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and like I said, it, it, it gives me a Photoshop feel. Don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to say it's wrong or right. I can't I can't say that for sure, but it gives me the Photoshop feel. All I can do is say that this is what they put out on their site and I'm going with it. Yeah, it, it looks a little weird to me. I'm not gonna say nothing because like I said, yeah. I've got one like that. Yep. Oh, and I've seen them before too. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, you come back I've later. Caught, like, I've, what I've the caught hell? them like that, so I'm not yeah. but and I understand where he's coming from though. Like I said, with that first photo, I don't I can't explain. Why we're not seeing her face other than the washout. So, right. Okay. So, I, we're at 107 now. I'm going to see if I got, I think I don't have anything. That's pretty much it. I got one more, but it's good old fashioned. Oh, wait. Same place, different times. I forgot about these because I was so fixated on the other one. These are taken by other people at different times. Same mirror, same everything. Well, I don't think it's the same mirror. They said it was the same mirror. It's not I don't the, same the same mirror because the room's totally different. Yeah. So this right here, they're saying that this is caught. 
somebody's walking by there. I'm sorry, that's just blurb of somebody walking in the in the the area right there. I think because it it blocks out the cabinet there too much. Yeah. So, I mean, I went this one. Yeah, I did this. I mean, I like the place. Don't get me wrong. The the, the stuff I've read on it, it's a really cool place, and there's probably stuff there you're gonna catch. I think this is just a misidentification of somebody walking that they didn't really realize was there. <coughs> but yeah, that's a different mirror, even though they said it's the same same mirror. But anyway. And then, okay, I got that. Those again. And then my favorite one. My absolute favorite one. <laughs> hey, I didn't put any thylacines up here. Right. This is from that uh, that infamous Yellowstone video where it looks like some hobbling Sasquatches walking behind the buffalo herd. This guy had to draw a circle on it. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. I've already pretty much debunked that entire thing as, a, as freaking complete hogwash because it, it doesn't even... Before you see this guy here, you see three or four walking exactly the same, hopping through here before this one guy comes out. It's complete Photoshop. It's complete, a complete ho hoax. It's not even a person walking back there, Grandizer. It is a complete hoax. Number one, if they're, I mean, they're back there. Look at how big he is back there. Yeah. And if they're walking around back there, you can bet these bad boys right here are going to know he's there. Yep, they're not going to ignore him for sure. No, so that is complete hogwash. I always leave it like that, and we go from there. So, all right, that's all I had this time. That's good. We did good. We're, we're going to do it again so sooner or later. Yeah, I've watched the video a hundred times. Air Force, I laugh every time. But anyway. we'll have another uh, installment of Lightning Round Sunday at another later date. Oh yeah, <laughs> different time, different time, different place. Lightning same Round background. Sunday. <laughs> but it was fun. I, I enjoyed that. That was that was fun. Just looking at stuff, and we did. Find, like I said, I found one that I really could not say anything. The, the tea room one caught me off guard. It really did. So yeah. I just like that. I'm gonna that, bring that, that, one that is very point. strange. Out of all of them, that. <sighs> We don't have enough information, so yeah. we can't make a educated, I mean. A, a confirmed guess. A, a confirmed guess, but we can make an educated guess and from yeah. the information we have, and I wouldn't throw it out. No, I would never throw that one out. No. Unless, unless I saw the video and I could tell for sure it was an actual bug on a lens, then I'd say, okay, yeah. But right, other than that, right. yeah, no. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's been fun. Next week, we might uh, go back to another uh, location somewhere. I may look something up this week and see what we can find. Nice, I, tried to do, I tried to do something like the Queen Mary before, but everything I find on Queen Mary has either been done or somebody's like, I'm like, okay, I'm bored with this now. I don't even want to go back into this because I can't find anything that's worth bringing out. So, But well, there's yeah. a lot of other places. Yes. You could try, what is it? The USS Lexington is in Corpus Christi. Yep, Lexington. Uh, the, there's also rumors that? about the, yep, that one. Uh, the tech, the, what was it? The, uh, the Battleship Texas has rumors of it as well. And right. I know the Missouri out, out in Honolulu did too. So, but those are, those are guys I don't Never know. <laughs> but yeah. I know um, because I don't know. I've, I've yeah, never but, investigated on a ship. You know, I've been on them where, where things have happened, but I didn't, yep. I wasn't there investigating. I was actually on a historic tour and, yeah. um, but I've never investigated, like really got into it. So I, th that would be a hard one for me to say it's yeah. real or it's not real. Yeah. I don't, you don't know. know what you're listening to and you've never I heard don't this know. stuff before. Exactly. Yeah. So that'd be fun one to actually do one day, but you know. I got a lot of them I want to see and I want to do before that. So that one's that was down on my my bucket list one, but it's still well, there. there. You go. There you go. There you go. All righty. Well, guys, appreciate y'all being here. We went about 15 minutes, 16 minutes over, but it was oh. fun. Y'all have fun. We'll see you next week. 7 p.m. Central anyway. We ain't even yeah. bumping into him. He's fine. N not anymore. He needs to quit bugging me. <laughs> right. All right. We'll see you guys next week.
Bye, everybody. Thank you.